Hello there, my spooky, scary skeletons. It's Coin Real Life, your guide to the ghoulish, your sharer of the spook, and a fan of all things frightful. Welcome back to another episode of my Halloween Spooktacular. So guys, even though it's still pretty early into October, we have to start thinking about our Halloween costumes. Because to me, it is one of the most important parts of Halloween. Because obviously, you dress up in a costume, you go trick-or-treating, you get candy, you eat the candy, and it's just a great thing. But you have to have a good costume if you want to go trick-or-treating. So, I thought that I would show you to get in some inspiration for maybe my costume this year. So, I thought that it'd be really fun to go through and look at some of my old Halloween costumes. So, let's do it. All right, guys, so let's get started in rain these costumes. I have my mom with me. Hi there. Okay, because we needed, I needed to have her with me because obviously I don't remember a lot about these costumes because I was one and going forward. And there's a lot of fun facts about them, so I wanted her to be here with me to kind of talk about them. Okay. So first we have 2003, and I was an angel for this costume. And was this handmade? I made that costume, yes. I wanted something simple. You were still a baby. You mm -hmm. weren't really walking very well, so I wanted something simple. I do have to say that I have to take some points off for the socks and sandals combo. That's not a good look. I have to say it's a cute costume. I'm not trying to be mean. It's a cute costume, but I know that there are better costumes. Oh, yeah. Definitely. So this, this one, one of my gets a 4 out of 10. Would you agree with this? I think that that's pretty generous. Okay. I would actually <laughs> probably rate it less. But you were still the cutest thing ever. And then we have Ty with us, and Ty was a little witch. She was a little witch. Yeah. That's so cute. I love this. That's a very cute picture. So, yeah, I would say a 4 out of 10. All right, let's go to 2004. Oh. This is a very cute costume. Another handmade one. Yes, this one, my yes. skills had improved by yes. this point. Okay, so I was Cinderella, right? Yes, because you That's were obsessed cute. with Cinderella. I was happy with this because I like it the had cape. a cape. Yes. Because it's cold at night and you were little. Oh, this is a good one. So we can see more of the dress itself. The sleeves look really good. All right. I like so this one. So like I this? would rate this one. This one gets a 5 out of 10 because I feel like the skills have improved from last time. But I feel like we st like the costumes still get really good. All right. Okay. We got 2005. And here I was Scary Godmother, um, which is actually a cartoon back from, I don't even know when it's from, the early 2000s, I think. And I was obsessed with it, and I loved it, and it was Halloween themed, and I still, I want to go back and rewatch it because it was really good. Um, but I wanted to be her for Halloween, and so here I am as Scary Godmother. Is this costume handmade? Okay, funny story about this costume. Mm -hmm. In my weird little mind, mm -hmm. I always thought that Halloween costumes should be handmade because my mom always handmade my costume. Mm -hmm. So to me, it wasn't a real Halloween costume unless it was handmade. Yes. And then we had gone to a Halloween store and found this costume, and I loved it so much. It's so cute. And I had this internal struggle with, <laughs> am I going to be a bad mom if I buy this Halloween costume wow. for her? So it was a struggle for me. But it it's very cute. It is very is a very cute costume. I love the hat. I love the little like sparkles really on the tool and the hat. This is very cute. I would definitely give this an eight out of ten. Yeah, it was because it's costume. it's a very cute costume. All right, let's continue on to two thousand six. <laughs> this is one of my favorite costumes of yours. <laughs> And I'm like, I love my face. Okay, in every picture, no joke, you look like you've been hitting the rock. <laughs> and I don't know what was up with that. I was just committed to my character, okay? Yes. Um, I was obviously Captain Hook. I Well, read what you Well, I was Captain that. Chloe. You just saw this and you thought, I have to be this. And of yes. course, then your dad drew the mustache and the beard on your That face. is a great costume. This is from Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, which we used to go to like religiously before I yep. graduated over to Scary Farm. Yep, yep. <laughs> so we were always going to Halloween events, okay? That yep. was consistent. <laughs> <laughs> Again, I expression. look lost. What happened? I look lost. 
Why do I look like a little man? Honestly, what it was is we would go and we'd spend the whole day and at the, Disneyland and doing then, like yeah. Halloween things and then the not so scary or whatever it was called. Yeah, the party. The, the Halloween party then was at night. So you were four by this time you were probably exhausted. Look at me though. Yeah. Okay, this is a this is a ten out of ten. This is a pretty good This costume. is a ten out of ten. You are so fantastic. Alright, let's move on to two thousand seven. Oh, this was the clown. I remember this one I now. I did not remember this. I remember, because I, I think we still have the wig. Okay, is so this handmade? It is not handmade. So wow. I just did you just gave up. Out. But I love the little pom-pom yes. shoes. I modified the shoes. so that Shoes look match. good. But it was funny because in every single picture I found of this costume... You are not smiling. <laughs> I don't know why. I look terrifying. In every single picture, no smile. I don't like it. It's I, scary. Know, Whose idea was it for me to be a clown? Was it my idea? I, don't, I would let I you don't do remember you this. Wanted. I would rate this costume because I was unhappy and it's scary. <laughs> this gets a 3 out of 10. Let's move on to 2008. Okay. Oh, yes. Here's Finally. Finally. <laughs> now Chloe can be scary. Six year old Chloe insisted on that being she scary. was going to be scary. Yep. And there was this no getting good. around it. This is a good costume. I was a ghoul. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like it. A l I like this pose, too. Yes. Being scary, committing being to Being scary. Role. Very scary. I think that this, what, this picture might have been. Um, on Halloween, but I think another picture that I have was a different, a different mm -hmm. makeup thing, a different oh, event. Oh, a, a makeup I test? You, I, I don't know that you like that makeup as well as you liked this makeup. Okay, so let's see. I don't like, I hate that makeup. I hate that makeup. But do you remember, didn't you have, was it a white shawl? Yeah, it's right here. And then did I, you have chains? I thought I had chains. I don't know why the chains aren't here. I hate this makeup. This makeup gets a 1 out of 10. It's terrifying and not in a good way. First, second makeup look, not good. Halloween makeup look was good. Halloween makeup look and costume gets like a good 7 out of 10. All right, so let's move on to, th to 2009. I have a guess about this one. I think it's the vampire one. Yes! <laughs> yes! Okay, this was the vampire costume that I thought that I was like Elvira in this costume. I didn't know who Elvira was, but I'm telling you, I had the same kind of thought. Wow, this is a great look. The hair, fantastic. I would wear my hair like this now. Oh, wow, there are the teeth. I like how you've added teeth and yet you're missing teeth. That is, wow, that is very scary. I also love the lashes that are way too big and are hanging off my face. This is great. Face. Very that scary. Face is a 10 out of 10. This is a haunt face. Yes, it is. It's this crazy. costume is a 10 out of 10. I love it. I would wear it now. Oh! <laughs> this was another costume. Iconic. This was another costume that I loved. I thought I was so cool in it. I thought, again, it was another costume where I'm like, I am... Elvira, the mistress of the dark. <laughs> like, I, I thought that I, like, like, the baddie level, that I can't think of any other word besides baddie. I felt like a baddie in this outfit. I felt like I was so cool because I thought it was, like, gothy. And I'm telling you, I thought that I was, like, I am so cool in this costume. I look like an adult in this costume. That's why I liked it. It's because it, like, kind of, I felt like an adult. Ooh. But she had some kick in makeup. That is a that is a makeup look. Yeah. That is a wow. makeup look. I would give this costume an 8 out of 10, personally, because I felt like the makeup could have been pushed a little bit more. <laughs> All right, let's go to 2011. Wait, wait, wait. Any guess? It's the evil queen. Okay, this costume was iconic. This is a 15 out of 10. You look at my hair. hair. Yeah. Oh, my and gosh. I Love my hair. And like the jewels, it was great. Let's go on to 2012. Yes, yes. Red Riding Hood. I think it was another adult costume that I wanted to yes. wear because I thought I was so cool. I and I remember I thought I was so cool because I wore fishnets. 
Oh, was that the first time? The first time I ever wore fishnets, oh, and I thought it was so cool. I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't get any cooler than this. That was some good makeup, though. That is, that is good makeup. I like it a lot. Remember my lips were sparkly? Because we, we got this, like, oh, red yes. sparkly powder, and we, like, dipped it on my lips. I oh, like this one. I would rate one? this one, like, an, like, an 8 out of 10. All right, now we have 2013. Okay. This is the spider. Okay, if, let's see, because I think this is my favorite year. Yes! Yes! Iconic. Best ever. No, Evil Queen's the best. I don't know. This one, this one is super cool because we had one. the spider webs on me. My like I just, my makeup in this one was great. And the spiders were crawling down my neck and they were on my tights. They were on your tights and then they were crawling up on your neck to say this is my favorite costume because I thought it was so unique and you can't see you'll see it in another you'll picture. You'll see it in another picture. But Chloe had a giant spider on her it back. It was a, such a cool costume. Freaked out. That oh and the like there was the spider like oh, eyeliner, spider yeah, a spider, we had spider web. web wow. My hair looks great. I think we put like great spray in it. That was an awesome costume. This gets like a 12 out of 10. This to me gets like a 25 out a of 25 10. 25 out of 10. All right. Okay, now that we're 2014, I okay, don't do know. Ideas? Let's see. <gasps> yes! And this was the very first year I went to Scary Farm was in 2014. And there was a maze called Forevermore. They had the raven was featured. And it was all about Edgar Allan Poe and his poems and short stories. And I read the raven. I became obsessed with it. And I think the feathers are so pretty. I think this is a really cool costume. I like this one. This one was not like handmade, but it was pieced together. Yes. Like we bought a lot of separate parts and then we pieced it together ourselves. I would give this one... Um, probably, I was thinking like an 8. Like an 8 out of 10, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Alright, now we have 2015. 2015. This year I was Darth Vader. <laughs> this costume is like not that good. It is not that good. I know, and I, I remember... Like, I, don't get me wrong, I like Star Wars, but I'm not like such a, a Star Wars person that I want to be Darth Vader for Halloween. I think I just wanted to look cool to impress the guy I, I like. I think I wanted different. to be something like cool. Alright, well I'll give you guys a little bit of information. Uh, the boy that I was trying to impress that Halloween um, actually ended up being my boyfriend, and it's Ben. That's the, that's the boy that I was trying to impress, yeah. is Ben, and... Um, I think obviously, he was. He was obviously. Obviously, obviously he was impressed. It just took a little bit longer. Yeah. All right, so let's move on to 2016. So 2016 uh -huh. is monumental. Why? Some. What was happening in 2016? It was S spectacular. Season one, first. and we were going to Japan. So there is no Halloween but costume. Technically, there's no. Wait. There's no, no true Halloween costume. No Halloween night trick or treat yes. costume. However, um, this is when we started doing spectacular. You were doing some Halloween events, so there yeah. were costumes that you wore. That yeah. let's look at it. All right, first, the doll. This is a great costume. I think this is not my personal favorite. No, we could have made improvements. I like the wig. And I think it should have had a petticoat underneath it. It should have. I don't, have. I don't... to wear it. And yeah, they were just tweaks. I hate the lipstick. Who said that this lipstick would be a good idea? This is not my favorite. I'm not a fan of it either. This costume gets a two improved. out of 10. All right. Yes! <laughs> Woohoo! Back to scary. Back to scary. Yes, this is when I my first time ever scaring, and I love this fantastic makeup. Um, my costume itself was pretty bland because you want to like obviously blend in, so it was just a turtleneck and leggings. It's kind of your goal. You wanted to scare in a haunt. I mean, yes, we had so just bad. Going to haunts a couple years before at Scary Farm, mm -hmm. and that was your goal. You wanted to scare, and then um, she got to do a guest appearance. A guest at scare. Sinister Point. At Sinister that Point, year. and it was uh, we fantastic. Went and, and and got friendly with the owners and. Yeah, they said we'd love to have you come down as like a guest, uh, mm -hmm. you know, a guest scarer for the night. And, and it was great. It I was think so much fun. Yeah, that. I was hooked. All right, now we have 2017. I know what I was for 2017. We were going to Japan a few days after no, we weren't the going. The next day. Oh, the next we day, left right? On November first. So again, Halloween. I still had to do something. Little, so Halloween yeah, got a little like. 
it was basically just getting ready to go. Yes, this so that's was the official. This is actually when I dyed my hair for the very first time. I dyed it purple and it just came out black. This costume is not my favorite. It was clothing. It's okay. It wasn't a yeah, it was yeah. clothing. It wasn't a costume. I will give it a five out of ten. This is fantastic. This was for an event where, as you can see, I love gluing bugs to my <laughs> yes. face and neck. This was a butterfly costume. I love this costume. It's so pretty. My mom actually made the skirt and she hand glued all like the flowers and everything. Fantastic job, I mom. Wish. It was really fantastic. Now I will say, this costume's great. I absolutely hated wearing it though because it was a very crowded party that we're at and those wings are big. Sure they itched bad. really bad. It was really painful. I remember when I took them off, my back was all red. I kept bumping into people and well, I, I couldn't walk anywhere. But it looks beautiful. I do so like, I'm going to give this a 15 out of 10. It was pretty good. Really, yeah, really good. I'm... Okay, so this is actually the same skirt from the costume before before we added the uh, flowers. the flowers, this was cool. The mask, did you hand bejewel it? Yes. Why do you do this to yourself? <laughs> I look at this costume and I'm like, whoa, okay. Uh, all the feathers were hand glued. Hand glued. This the is intense. Was handmade. My shoes were so cool. We thrifted them, and they had like all like matching little it jewels like a on peacock. them. Yeah, it was so cool. Them. Oh, I there's love. the back. There's the tail. This is a very cool costume. And your hair. I don't know. My hair tell. was cool. It was all done up and there were peacock flowers in her hair or peacock feathers. Yeah. I would give this one, I have to say, I like the butterfly one a little too. bit better. So I would give this one a 10 out of 10. Oh, it, was, it was a statement costume. <laughs> it was. Nice. So here we have 2018. This isn't my favorite costume. I'm it just going to really say, because it's very hard, because we really wanted to do a couple costume. We really wanted to do one, and it, we couldn't decide on anything until I feel like it was like a week or two before Halloween. But people knew. People knew were. instantly, and it and was very cute. It. They really liked the costume. The it was Wanda Cosmo and Wando, yeah, yeah, from Fairly Odd, Fairly Odd Parents. It was okay. I would give it probably a 7 out of 10. Yeah, All right, good. now we have 2018 Part 2. Oh, yes. Woo! Yes, yes, yes. Okay, this was Scrappy Doo. This was when we were doing a Halloween event where we were going to watch the Scooby Doo movie. And the tail. The tail is very cute. But people loved that dress, too. Do you remember? People really liked it. People the loved this costume. This was a very cute costume, though. I would have to give that one, that a, a good one. like an 8 out of 10. All right, now we have part three. Oh my gosh, I had so many costumes. Ah, oh, this was a really good one for multiple reasons. This is when I was scaring again, I guess scared at Sinister Point. I love the veins. I think they're so creepy. I love the like uh it was mouthwash with Makes black food coloring. Food coloring. Yeah. And I loved this costume because it was a nightgown. And one thing about Haunt is that it is so hot and you get so hot. All right, let's do 2019. I obviously know what 2019 is because it was last year, but I'm excited about the other costumes. So first, here we have Yay. another. I really like this one, this okay? This was a great costume. This was a very, very cute costume. We were Pam and Jim from The Office because we were obsessed with watching The Office at that time. I love, by the way, Pam rocking the black nail polish. Oh, gosh. <laughs> but... Uh, yeah, that was a yeah, very cute costume. costume. I actually found, like, I really like this outfit. It was, the whole thing was from Goodwill. And your hair was curly. It was curly. Yeah. I, I, you can't really see it as well here, but this was a very cute costume. I would give this a 9 out of 10. A lot of people yeah. knew who we were. And as we were walking and trick-or-treating, we met a little tiny, they must have been like 10 years old, a Michael and Dwight, and they were <laughs> so cute i love them those were my halloween costumes throughout the years i haven't decided what i want to be i know that everyone and their moms are being the among us characters from the video game which if you don't know basically they're little like spacemen astronauts um and i've debated that idea but you know everyone's doing that so i don't want to i want to be i want to be special um and so i'm thinking about what i should be for halloween i'm kicking around a few ideas now I feel like I've lost my like wanting to be something scary and now I want to do more like joke and silly costumes. Um, 
so we'll see. We shall see. Comment down below if you have any suggestions about what I should be for Halloween, because I'd really like to see. Or comment down below what you're going to be for Halloween this year, because I would like to know. My favorite costume is probably either the spider or the evil queen. Those are probably my faves. What about you? I would say the spider or the butterfly. The butterfly was good. The spider and the butterfly were my favorite. What was your guys' favorite Halloween costume? Let me know in the comments down below. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a spooky video just like this one. I will see you all next time. Don't forget to stay spooky. Bye, guys. Bye.